Okay, so bending the knees very slightly, just a very slight bend in the knees. Legs are shoulder width apart. The hands are going to turn, turning the arms so that this fleshy part between the thumb and index the finger is lined up with the crease in your pants. And the jaw slightly tilts down, elongating the neck. And the action in the hips, I tuck the buttocks in a little bit and that it gives kind of the sensation of both sitting down and standing up at the same time. So the weight is slightly, slightly back, it's, but you want it evenly distributed on your feet. You should feel a little arc in the knees, a rounding. And bringing your awareness to the top of the head. and spiraling down the body with a body scan, relaxing as we go. So relaxing the top of the head, relaxing towards the left, the back of the head, the right, the forehead, the left ear, the left, the center of the back of the head, the right ear, letting go of all tension as we scan, the right eye and eyebrow, the middle, the left eye and eyebrow, down to the left jaw line, back of the nape of the neck, the right jaw line, the jaw, the cheeks, the neck, the back of the neck, my right shoulder, collarbone, esophagus, left shoulder, left shoulder blade, the middle of that upper region of the back, right shoulder blade, right bicep, sternum, left broad bicep, middle of the back, right forearm, abdominal, left forearm, lower back, right hand, pelvis, upper thigh, right upper thigh, left upper thigh, buttocks. Now, there's an automatic response of the muscles to tense up in the thighs, but really let your tendons hold the weight of your body. Your skeleton is made to be held by the tendons, so it's a relaxing of these muscles that rush to assist. Relaxing the knees, my right knee, my left knee, the back of the knees, relaxing the right calf, front shin, the right, sh the left shin, left calf, relaxing the ankle, my right ankle, my right 
top of the foot, left top of the foot, left ankle, and bringing the awareness to the bottoms of the feet, relaxing everything in the body, and even extending awareness three, about three feet below the feet into the earth. And bringing awareness back up the legs, summoning energy up the knee, the thighs, and the arms come up like two letter C's. There's kind of a cascading of the hands where the pinky is closest to the body and the index is the farthest finger from the body, so kind of creating steps on the hands. Very relaxed, relax the shoulders, relax the thumbs, and hold the tree. Now I bring my awareness, I split my awareness to the lower Dantian, about an inch beneath the, label, the navel and the top of my head. So breathing from the Dantian. Wherever I feel tension in the body, I bring my awareness there to kind of unravel the tension and relax. The breath should be soft. See if you can breathe without hearing yourself. So really soften the breath. When the arms get heavy, simply extend them more, kind of stretch them out and bring them back in. You probably have to do that a few times in this 45 minute meditation. As you can see, my Hands are kind of lined up with the chest, facing the heart. And when you reach 40 or 45 minutes, maybe a, you sound an alarm, slowly bring the hands back down. Keep the posture and bring the legs together. You're going to want to stretch your knees. Hands on the thighs and making circles with the knees. Another way. And down. And packing the chi back into the body. Open hand. And we're going down the meridian lines. It's really hot here right now. And down the back. And the top of the hand. And knuckles. All the way down the meridians. And the top of the knuckles. It's like the fingertips in a, in a knuckle. Top finger knuckle.
bringing the feet together, right over left, holding at the Dantian, it's my belly button right here. And we're going to do 36 circles clockwise, 24 counterclockwise. I do sets of 12. find yourself burping. Left arm up, right arm underneath, step back with the right, good job.